Dolphins and the Raiders, to attack by Lowe, and not going to suit up in this game. And I'm saying it's not really a bad thing when you take a look overall at the Miami offense. To attack by Lowe, more of a game managing quarterback here in the NFL, over to a game manager, basically in Jacoby Brissett, who's a little bit more of a veteran, has more games under his belt in the NFL. Does that equate to success? Not necessarily. But if you look last week and said, oh, they didn't even score any points against Buffalo Bills, Jacoby Brissett played a lot of the game. Trust me. Quarterbacks in the NFL that aren't starters don't even pick up a football with the starting offense during the week, and then are just thrust in. Hey, by the way, you healthy? You limber over there? Was your what was your mindset coming into this week? They all say the same thing. Oh, you know what? I'm ready to start at any time. Come on, man. It's late at night. You picking up that playbook when you know you're probably a 90% chance you're not going to play this weekend? Hey, do I want to go over these extra plays and watch film? Yeah, coach, I got that handled already. You're playing some Xbox and just relaxing at home on a Thursday night. Now you're the starter. You're getting starter reps during the week. We're taking a look at this line at a four to four and a half. Now, I do agree with the line movement going up. We were a little bit worried about what we were getting out of Derek Carr early in the week. That ankle injury flared up uh, against the Pittsburgh Steelers. John Gruden said everything's a OK. He's practicing, should be good to go. I like the Raiders, but now with the price points we are looking at here, because correct me if I'm wrong, opening day, they weren't a favorite to beat the Baltimore Ravens. Going into Pittsburgh, not a favorite to beat the Pittsburgh Steelers. Now at home, they are favored to beat the Miami Dolphins. I think the Miami Dolphins are going to be able to keep this game close. If I'm getting the four and a half, I'm leaning towards the Dolphins. Will Fuller is back. But here's the issue where I haven't made a wager on this game yet. You guys know me. I'm trying to find a way to take the Miami Dolphins with their team total. Watch a lot of film with Jacoby Brissett. Even went back to some games that he started in years past. He has the chops to do it. But is the game plan going to facilitate that? Or are we dinking and dunking up and down the field just to try to stay close and see what we can do? The key in this betting business, Kyle, is rule number one. Donnie, don't outsmart yourself for no reason here. And I'm trying not to do that in this game. Yeah, I can't back the Dolphins in any way, shape, or form. Just simply cannot do it. And look, the Raiders have come out and put up points and moved the ball against two good defenses when I certainly didn't expect it. So I got to eat some crow there. The offenses look good, and they've had no Josh Jacobs. They've been throwing the ball. Yes, the Dolphins have two excellent corners on the outside, but there are advantages in the middle of the field. Waller and Hunter Renfro should be open all day against Nick Needham and those safeties. Were you inspired by anything you saw to Jacoby Brissett when he came in that game last week? They couldn't score a damn point when they're when the Bills are just basically sitting back playing prevent vanilla defense up, you know, 28, 35, nothing. So, no. Uh, and I do agree. The whole everyone and their mother is in on the Raiders. It will be a huge coup for the books if the Dolphins are able to pull this off. But I got to eat some crow here on the Raiders. They, they have, to me, they've been the biggest surprise and the most impressive star. We thought they could be with looking Carolina. Forward. Them and Carolina. Yeah, with them and yeah. Carolina. Absolutely. We were talking about the schedule. They they could come out 0-3. It's going to be a long year. Here they are, 2-0, and beating two playoff teams. I think they'd be a third team who was close to the playoffs. I like the Raiders here. I just don't see how you could back Jacoby Brissett right now. What in the hell is he going to do? He's going to make the Raiders defense look better than it is, and it hasn't been god-awful. I like the Raiders here. I think they cover, and I think that Raiders team total over 23.5 is absolutely live. That was close to getting the seal of approval. I just backed off, but 23.5 here at, what, minus 130? The Raiders should get to 24 points in this game. Yeah, it's going to be an interesting one. You can see the, uh, you know, my hesitation here because I know I'm going to have my finger over the trigger with the Dolphins sometime between now and late Saturday That's night. Scary. I just want to make sure I make the right decision, which is why I haven't pulled the trigger. I need a little bit more around me. I want to make sure Will Fuller actually doesn't disappear midweek again and he actually shows up and plays in this football game because he can help. He plays a big part of that offense because if you can run straight and run fast, Kyle, there is a job for you in the NFL to open up the rest of that passing game. We'll see if it happens. But it's a good game. It's a really good game to think about. I'm going to tell you the game we're going to go over right now. 